originally established by the United States Army Air Force in 1928. The Yuma Army Airfield was transferred to the Department of the Navy in 1959 and redesignated to Marine Corps Air Station Yuma in 1962. From there, the Marines at MCAS Yuma dedicated themselves to making the air station the busiest in the Marine Corps. There are multiple commands on Marine Corps Air Station Yuma that provide aerial and ground support training to U.S. and Allied forces from around the world. Among those commands is Marine Fighter Training Squadron 401, a reserve squadron that provides aerial adversary and aggressor services to other U.S. military branches and several Allied, NATO, and coalition partners. MCAS Yuma is also home to Marine Aviation Weapons and Tactics Squadron 1, a training squadron that conducts aerial training for tactical aviation units around the Marine Corps. Another command is Marine Test and Evaluation Squadron 1, which tests various aircraft, aviation command and control systems, weapon systems, and associated equipment. In the 1980s, the air station became the primary operating base for Fleet Marine Force Pacific's cadre of AV-8V Harrier II jets. In the 1990s, it also supported Marine Unmanned Aerial Vehicle Squadron 1 during drug and immigration enforcement missions in Mexico. And in 2012, MCAS Yuma became the Marine Corps' initial operating base for the F-35 Bravo. Marine Corps Air Station Yuma has been on the forefront of marine aviation and innovation for the last 60 years and will continue to do so for many more.